Hello. Hello, 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 guys. Hello, welcome, teacher. Welcome, Pedro. Pedro Ricardo Ramirez, Lucia Pacheco. Nice to see you. How are you guys? How are you, Ricardo? How was the gym? You go to the gym, right? No, you don't? In my house. Who goes to the gym? Somebody here. Somebody here goes to the gym. All right, very good. to play basketball. Oh, you play basketball. Yeah. I remember Alan played basketball. Yeah. Hey, what, what happened to Alan? I thought that he was going to be here. I don't know. No. I think he, he is not here. All right. Yeah, no, he's not. He's not in the group. At least he wasn't here yesterday, so I'm not sure. If, if he is, you know, he still hasn't come to class. All right. Very good. All right. Uh, welcome, guys. All right. Remember to remember to turn on your cameras, guys. Okay. Lucia Pacheco, welcome. Uh, Jocelyn, how are you, Jocelyn? All good? Mr. Barahona, Marco, how's everything going Hello, today? Teacher. All good, 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 good. All right, Luis Molina, welcome back. Modo serio. All right, guys. Thank you, thank you, teacher. Intermediate. Right, all right, right. Intermediate. Intermediate. Intermediate, okay. All right, Lucia, nice to see you. How was uh, how was school today? I, I sleep every day, uh, all day, as you can. You slept all day? Yeah, I feel Even, a bit sick. You, oh, okay. All right. What do you What do you get? Did you calm uh, down? Did you calm uh, down with the flu? Yes, I think that because I don't see uh, another symptom. You don't have it's another. A cold down. Yes, yes. I don't have. Uh, it's a cold down and headaches. Okay. Very good. Although I guess I'm sending a message to everyone right now. So. All right, very good. Uh, what about you, Jocelyn? How was your day? Jocelyn and Sofia? Not there? All right, very good. Luis Molina, how was your day, Mr. Molina? Mr. Mr. Molina. So, sorry, my my micro. Oh, it's was okay. Smooth. It's, yeah. It was muted. Uh, huh? Yeah, my my day was a great teacher. Thank you. Uh, I was a working, uh, but more. Uh, I was a study with my little boy too. Oh, nice. So you have yeah. a kid. How old uh -huh. is how old is he? Yeah, yeah, ten years old. Oh, okay. All right. Hey, that's uh -huh. that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Uh -huh. All right, guys. All right. Anyways, welcome, Rocio. Nice to see you here. Let's get started, guys. Today we are going to have your grammar class. All right, because I know that you were eager to have your grammar class right now. Okay. And today, guys, we are going to learn. All right. Let's pull up the platform first. Hold on. All right. So everybody, got, uh, do my favor, guys. Everybody, go to section number one. Okay. Hello, Rocio. Nice background. In what country are you in today? Okay, <laughs> hello, teacher. Yes, hello. My, what what my, country? Uh huh. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Is my yard or <laughs> I don't know? <laughs> oh, your your backyard? Yes. Oh, okay. But it's right. real, teacher. <laughs> no, I know, I know. <laughs> I know. Come on. No, this this is my house. See? Okay. My house right now. I live in New York right now. Uh, very good, guys. Okay, that's that's okay. I understand that. All right, guys. So we're gonna talk about passives today, guys. Okay. All right. So now that almost everyone is here, guys. Okay, let's bring this up. What happened with those those courses? What? What type uh, of English is that? Sorry, <laughs> sorry, a little conversation with my 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 son because uh, the question is a uh, 
I have appeared in my platform uh, the two course and oh, uh, be, be careful started Black. November 22 and they have ended John 6 but and the mistake is to open the last the last mod module module the last yes. module and the present module is um, is the mistake is that to start is a uh, chain that because uh, it's possible um, the error in the in the platform in the peer the two module okay. I have the two module and the repeat the same module and module three and if possible the I have a little problem I imagine in the future with the to maintain this in the last module three. Okay, all right. Very good, guys. So, um, okay, I, I understand, Pedro. I understand. All right, now, guys, uh, be careful, guys. It's not platform, it's platform, okay? Not platanoforma, right? Platform. Platform. All right. Very good, guys. So, uh, let's move on, guys. All right, okay. Um, so, today, guys, we're going to talk about passive voice. Um, does anybody have any idea what passive voice is? Jimmy, welcome. Jacqueline, welcome. Nice to see you. All right, passive voice, guys. No idea? Yes, no, maybe? No, teacher. All right. So let's talk about it, guys, okay? So first of all, guys, passive voice, what do we use it for, Rocio? What are the three main uses of passive voice? Okay, the... Uh... Number one, we don't know who did the actions. Number two, there is no doer of the action. And uh, number three, the fat is more important than the door of the action. Very good, okay. We don't know who did the action. There is no doer of the action. And the fact is more important mm -hmm. than the doer of the action, okay? All right, guys. All right, okay. Uh, this will all make sense later, guys, okay? All right, let's take a look at some examples and we'll go from there, right? Rocio, pick someone who likes to listen to Cheyenne. Okay. Um, let me see. Just pick someone. Anna, nice to you, Anna. <laughs> okay. Uh, Jorge. Jorge, let's go, Jorge. Uh, uh, sorry, teacher. Reading. Yes. Help me read the. Um, help me read the the first example. Okay. Uh, uh, the president opened the build the building in one night three one. Okay. All right. The president. Repeat. Everybody. Repeat. The president opened the building in nineteen thirty one. The president opened the building in 1931. All right, very good. Guys, can somebody do me a favor and resend the invitation on the WhatsApp group? Because there are some people trying to join and they can't. So the same info, I think I got it here. But... No. Yeah, can somebody do me that favor, guys? Just send the, the invitation over to the WhatsApp group again. Right. Very good, guys. Okay. All right, guys. So, uh, notice something, guys. Okay. The active voice, okay, it's a regular sentence. All right. So, give me, uh, for example, okay, we're going to focus, guys, on simple past right now. All right. So, notice something. Um, what is, what is, um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Tatiana. All right, Tatiana, give me a sentence in simple past. Simple past. Uh-huh. For example, I ran yesterday, right? Right. Okay, yeah. I ran, uh, for example, I ran yesterday at, at 6 a.m., okay? All right, so this is an example of, uh, of a sentence in simple past, okay? All right, so give me another example.
¿Te tiene? Um, um, I woke up early. Uh, okay. Okay. I woke woke up early. Okay. Now, let me ask you something, guys. Do you think that this can this can be transformed into uh, a passive voice or not? What do you think? Elizabeth? Not. <laughs> All right. She, no, guys. she she woke up early now. No. Okay. No, was, guys. All right. We need something else, guys. Was, okay. She was. All right. Let's take a look at the first example. Okay. Let's break down this. Let, let's break this down, guys. Okay. The president. Teacher. Okay, what? Tell me. For example, in, the, in this example, in the Tatiana, and I was, it's possible to say in that I was woke up uh, by, by, I, I don't know what, remember that, early, uh, or by, by the party yesterday, or by the party in the night yesterday. We're, we are getting there. Uh, in that example, no, we couldn't have transform that sentence into a passive because we need more elements, all right? We'll, we'll get there, okay? Uh, you're on the right path, Pedro, but no, we couldn't have transformed it because we're not in the right, I mean, uh, we're missing elements from the parts of speech, you know, from the grammar structure, so we can turn it into passive, okay? All right, guys, but um, don't worry about that right now, guys, okay? Because otherwise you're gonna get very confused, okay? Right now, guys, I want, let's, let's do it uh, step by step. All right, the president, what is, what is the president in grammar, guys? So oh, yeah. It is the subject oh, yeah. of the sentence, right? Okay, what is, what is open? The verb. The verb. The verb in what tense? Verb. Simple past. Uh, simple past. The verb in the past, very good, okay. What about the building in 1931? Compliment. 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 Okay, no all right. Problem. But more importantly, guys, the compliment, it has an object, okay? All right, remember, the object of a sentence is, okay, it's what we talk about. What is the object of a sentence, guys? It's what we talk about. It's what, okay. we, talk it's about. what we talk about. Talk about. Okay, all right. It's what, very good, guys. It's what the subject talks about, okay? Very good. All right, so the president, Open plus an object of the sentence, okay? Oops, this should be down here. Okay, the building. Okay. So let's put it like this. The building, which would be the object in 1931. This would be the complement, okay? Building, and then in 1931, this is complement, okay? All right, guys. Take a screenshot, uh, take a screenshot or just uh, write it down in your notebook, whatever you want to do, guys, okay? Doesn't matter. All right, guys, so the president opened the building in 1931, okay? Now, let's take a look at another example, guys, okay? Uh, help me read the second example, uh, Ana Contreras. Let's go, Ana. Let's read American Architect. Um, the, um, my friends. Oh, no, an American oh, architect. Uh, uh, let, let's just read the second example. Read. Oh, sorry, sorry. Yes, yes, an yes, American uh, architect designed the building. Very good. An American ar architect designed that building, right? All right. Now, let me ask you something, guys. Do we have do we have a subject in this sentence? Yes or not? An American. Artist. An American, right? An American is the, the what, guys? Leah Campos, what is the subject? Very good, okay? An American is the subject, okay? An American architect, guys, is the okay. subject, okay? Yeah. What is the sign, guys? What is the sign, uh, Jacqueline? The verb. The verb. The, verb. The, the verb in what tense? Past. Okay, the verb in the past. Okay, and what is the building? 
Compliment. Forget. Compliment. Forget. The object. The object. object. Guys. Okay, the object, object. 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 Okay. All right. Very good. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, so far, so good, guys. Clear, clear as tequila. Clear as as water. Clear as milk. As coffee. What do you think? It's clear. All right. Do we need more examples? Do you want more examples? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Right. Yes, please. I, I said I said tequila and Jimmy started smiling. All right, no, Jimmy, it's not it's not the time yet. It's not the time yet, Jimmy. All right. Tomorrow, tomorrow. Tomorrow, Jimmy. Oh no, no, not tomorrow, guys. Tomorrow you have to come to class. All right. <laughs> On Saturday, all right? Saturday. On Saturday. Tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow wow. night, right? <laughs> all right. Very good, guys. Okay. All right, guys, so let's take a look at another example. But this time around, guys, all right, I'm going to give you one example, and then you're going to give me your examples. Uh, you're going to send them in the chat room. Okay? Yes. All right, so we're going to talk about simple paths, okay? We're just focusing on simple paths right now, okay? All right, so give me a subject, guys. Let's, let's, bring, let's build this up together, okay? Give me a subject. Jocelyn, give me a subject. Shakira. All right, very good, okay? Chayanne, very good. All right, Cheyenne, uh huh. Cheyenne, Cheyenne, what? Drunk, drunk. Dance, complete. dance. <laughs> Remember, guys, we need. What do we need here? What is this, the, the 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 second the part verb? of the structure? We need the, the verb. verb. The verb. The verb. The verb in what tense, guys? Past. 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 The verb past in the past, right? So Cheyenne, what? Drank. Cheyenne, Cheyenne drank. All right, Cheyenne drank what? No. No? <laughs> so Cheyenne drank what, guys? Pink hair. Water. Cheyenne drank? Tequila. Tea. Whiskey. Cheyenne drank whiskey. Okay. Uh-huh. Let's add a compliment. All right, let's add a compliment. Give me a compliment. Very nice. Olipa. At the party. Okay. During the party. Okay, at the party, okay. All right. Yes. Cheyenne, I'm not going to add Dua Lipa. You can say with Dua Lipa too, but I'm not going to add her because you are going to get confused, okay? All right. That will be part of the subject too. All right. So Cheyenne drank whiskey at the party. All right. Let's, let's, let's see, guys, if this, this can be transformed into a passive, um, into passive voice, okay? All right. Now, uh, let's see, guys. Do we have a subject, guys? Do we have a subject in this sentence, Jocelyn? Yes, Cheyenne. Yes, Cheyenne. Right. Yes, Cheyenne, all right. And uh, what is the, do we have the other part of the, the structure? What is the, what is the next part of the structure? Verb. verb. The verb in the past. Do we have a verb in the past? Yes, okay, we have a verb in the past, okay. Do we have an object, uh, Blanca? Um, whiskey. Whiskey, okay. All whiskey right. The object. Huh? And the party. Very good, okay. At the, at the party. party is the what? What is at the party, guys? Okay, at the party is the compliment. Very good, guys. So now, see, guys. So we have all the cocktail, all, all the ingredients, guys, to make this into a passive voice, okay? All right, so now, uh, do me a favor, guys. Everybody send me right now, guys, one example a simple past using a subject, a verb in the past, an object, and a compliment, okay? Everybody, right now, guys, okay? Let's go. Send an example in the chat room, guys. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Jesus Christ. All right, meanwhile, okay, I'm going to be asking what each of you, okay? Uh, real quick, Italo. Italo Gonzalez, are you there, sir? Oh, I, uh, you have issues with your microphone. Hi. Hi. Hi oh, there you go, Italo. We can hear you now. All right, Italo, give me, give me an example, Italo. In, in active? Yes, in active voice, yes. Um, my dough is cookie. 
My dog Eve, guys. My dog Eve. Cookies. Cookies. All right. What is what is what is wrong here, guys? My dog Eve. Eight. Okay, eight. my dog ate. Right. We're talking about the past. My dog ate. Okay. Eight. Eight. All right. What are what else are we missing here, guys? What else do we need in the structure? The complement. Okay. We need an okay. object, okay? All right. My dog ate. Your food. Okay, it's my food. dog ate. Ate his food. All right. Uh, what else do we need? It's consumption. consumption. Okay, but. Compliment. Okay, my dog ate his food. Very fast. Very fast, okay? All right. Very fast, okay? Okay, very good. Okay, so the adverb. Okay, we're using an adverb now. Okay, good job, guys. Okay, let me check on your examples. Uh, Jorge says, the restaurant closed the doors in 1980. Very good. Uh, Elizabeth says, my pet died three years ago. And my, it, it's actually in my backyard, Elizabeth, and I'm so sorry to hear that. <laughs> if it is true. I don't know if it's just an example. <laughs> uh, but uh, my pet died in, uh, died in the backyard three years ago. It should be the other, the other way around. Uh, Jocelyn, uh, my mom cooked a cake yesterday. Very good. Marco Barahona, Jorge Gonzalez played on, in Spain. The preposition, Marco, it's in Spain, not on Spain, okay? Okay. In Spain in 1984. Uh, Jacqueline, Queen played, played live, okay? Just live, right? There's no name for prepositions or articles. Uh, so Queen played live. Uh, oh, no, no, no. I, I see. Queen played at the live aid. Okay, yeah, in 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 the in the eighties. Okay, you're missing the article in uh that after in in the eighties. Okay, uh, Rocio Shakira ate pupusas last year. Okay, uh, Jorge, I walked the mountain in ninety in the nineties. You're missing the article that Jorge in that nineties. Okay, uh, Tatiana Teresa painted her house. Very good. My parents lived together for sixty five years. Very good, Anna. Ricardo, my daughter played basketball. All right, there, when you say last weekend, you do not use the article that, all right? So my daughter played basketball last weekend with her cat. Jimmy, the cat ate a mouse yesterday. Luis Molina Maradona died in Argentina yesterday. Oh yeah. Uh, he, my sister began his bad behavior. Okay, all right, this isn't complete actually. Lucia Pacheco, Shakespeare. Ah. Brother Romeo and Juliet, actually, in 19, in 1595. Carla Pedro won the lottery last year. Very good. Maradona lied, died in Argentina in 2020. My husband, my husband uh, played the piano, Blanca. My brother bought a, bought a red car. My pet died in the backyard three years ago. My son, all right, not three, three, all right? My son ate chicken soup. Very good job. All right, guys. Good, good, good job. All right, very good. Hey, guys, thank you for helping, helping with the other guys. All right, guys. Very good. You all gave me good examples, okay? So thank you because that shows me that you understood that part. All right. So now, guys, let's change the focus of the sentence. And how do we change the focus of the sentence, guys? Uh-huh. We change the focus of the sentence with passive voice. We change it with what, guys? With passive voice. With everybody, we change it with what? Everybody, with what do we change? Voice. Very good. We, we change it with passive voice, guys, okay? All right? We change it con el chico pasivo, right? No, guys, passive voice, not voice, right? All right. <laughs> All right. Very good. All right, guys. So now the, in the first example, they say the president opened the building in 1931. I, no, no. I was going to say, I was going to talk about your examples, guys. Okay. My dog ate his food very fast. Okay. So let's take a look at this example, guys. How do we transform that into fast food? Okay. So first of all, guys, the object of the sentence, guys, becomes becomes um, the main protagonist, okay? So you say, uh, the food 
was eaten by my dog very fast. Okay? All right. So now, notice something, guys, okay? Um, I'm going to write it down again here. Okay, so I have to say my dog ate his food very fast, okay? All right, guys, so what, what difference... What difference do you notice, guys? First of all, does it mean the same, guys? Does it mean the same? Yeah. All right. Yes, it means the same, right? But now, guys, what is the focus? All right. The before, focus guys, is in the food. The food. Very good. The focus is in the food now. So notice, guys. Before, guys, we were talking. The focus was on, on what? The dog. The dog. All right. Dog. And the dog was the what? Hey. Again. It was the subject, okay? All right. Now, in this case, guys, the dog is the what? The complement. Yeah. All right? Object. Uh, object. This, object. Okay, it becomes the object here, object. okay? All right. So, notice something, guys. Okay, so what happens, guys, is that the object of the sentence, okay, this right here, right? This comes, object. Okay, this comes in first place, guys, okay? All right. So, in this case, guys, okay, the food becomes the subject of the sentence, okay? So the focus, guys, right? So there is a focus here, focus, right? And here we have the focus here, see? Focus, okay? All right? So notice, guys, the focus came over the object of the sentence now, okay? So we're not focusing on my dog, which is the subject. We're going to focus on his food, all right? Is that clear, guys? Another example? Yes, please. All right, very good. All right, let's go yes. with another example. Uh, 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 all right, let, I'm going to use one of your examples, guys, okay? I like to steal hearts and examples. Very good. <laughs> all right, guys, so let's talk about uh, Cheyenne, okay? Cheyenne drank whiskey at the party. All right, guys. So again, uh, let's see. With Dua Lipa. Okay, with Dua Lipa. Okay, we're going to add Dua Lipa later, guys, because I'm going to get you confused if we add Dua Lipa, okay? I know how to explain it, but uh, you're going to get confused if, if we start adding more sub, more uh, um, pronouns or nouns into the sentence, okay? But don't worry, okay? We can add Dua Lipa. I promise we'll, we'll add Dua Lipa later, right? But right now, let's focus on this. So Cheyenne drank whiskey at the party. All right, so let's see who has not participated. Oh, uh, Leah Campos, what is the object of this of the of the sentence here? Cheyenne drank whiskey at the party. What what is the object of the sentence? Whiskey. Whiskey. What is it, Leah? Leah Campos. Thank you, Leah Campos. <laughs> what is it? Meow meow meow. All right, Leah, you're muted. Uh, you have your microphone on mute. There you go. Hello? Yes, there you go. Hello? Yeah, we can hear you now. Yes, we can hear you. Hello. The subject is uh, Chayan. Uh, and the object? What uh, is the object of the uh, sentence? Object. Um, uh, the uh, drone whiskey. All right, no, drank is the verb. Whiskey is the object. Whiskey. Okay. Very good, okay. So whiskey. what comes, so in whiskey. Passive, so in passive voice, whiskey. guys, in passive voice, what comes first? Jocelyn, in passive voice, what are we gonna, what are we gonna use first in passive voice? The object. We're gonna use the object, right? So in this case, the object is what? Whiskey. Whiskey, very good. So whiskey, all right. Now notice something, guys. We're gonna use the verb, what is was, guys? What is the base form of the verb was? Was for three, three person. To be, guys, okay? This is to be, okay? All right. All right. Is this for plural or singular? Singular. singular. All right. This is for singular, okay? Singular. singular. All right. Very good. Uh, Marco Barahona, what comes next? So we have the object, and then we have uh, we have the verb. Okay, we have the verb in the past form, right? Whiskey. Whiskey was, was, was drunk. Very good, okay.
Guys, what is the third form of the verb drink? What is the third form? What is the past participle of the verb drink? Drunk. Drunk. Very good. Drunk. Okay, right. Drunk. Very Drunk. good. Uh, eso sí se la recuerdan, ¿verdad? Ah, uh, very good. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I uh, whiskey was drunk. Um. Okay. Now, what comes after the, the, the structure, guys? Past participle and what? What preposition do we use here? Bye. Uh, Bye. Very Bye. good. Bye. Okay. Bye. Bye, Cheyenne. 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 I promise, I promise you party. that party. we're going to use the Lipa. Cheyenne drink whiskey at the party with Dua Lipa. Okay, so now, everything is good so far, okay? By Dua Lipa. So, if I want to say, guys, Cheyenne was, Cheyenne was drunk. Yeah. Whiskey, whiskey was drunk by Cheyenne. So, if I want to say Dua Lipa here, what do I do? With Dua Lipa. And Dua Lipa. And Dua Lipa. Very good. Okay, simple as that, guys. Got it? Got it? Got it? What do you say? Dua Dua Lipa. Chupadero. What? I don't know. It's similar. Yeah, yeah, it's similar. Come on, man. It's singular. You guys are bad. It's the same juice. She's a girl. All right, she's she's a singer. All right, she's a singer. She's a she's a beautiful singer. All right, all right. Good job, guys. Good job. <laughs> what is Dua Lipa? <laughs> it's a computer. All right. All right. Very good. No malos. Right. Good job, guys. Okay. Very good. Another example, guys. Another example, or or do you think that you understood clear as clear as whiskey or clear as as vodka? Bye. Bye. Another one, example? One example. All right, very good. Another example, okay. One. All right, you give me an example, guys. You give me one example in the past and let's transform it in uh, in passive voice, okay? Now, oh, let's use, you know what? Let's use, let's, let's use, let's use a plural noun, okay? Let's use a plural noun. Like they or we, okay? So Here's let's use... my example. <laughs> the le what, what is your example, Jacqueline? About Queen playing playing in the Live Aid concert. Oh, okay, very good. Okay, all right. Let's use that, and then we we are gonna use the plural. Okay. Actually, let's talk about Queens. Okay, Queen Queen. What what was your example? Because I I closed the chat window. Hold on. Uh, I don't remember pretty well. <laughs> Queen play, played at. At the live aid. Okay. Play. Okay. Queen played at the live. Okay. Live aid. Uh huh. In, in the eighties. Okay. At the live aid concert. All right. Concert. In the eighties. Okay. Good job. All right. Good example. Okay, guys. So first of all, remember. <clears throat> In passive voice, the first part is what? Concert. The what, guys? The grammar part of it. What is the it? Object. The yeah, object. The object. Okay, the object of the sentence. Lucia, Lucia. <laughs> Lucia Pacheco. <laughs> All right. Uh, hey, Lucia is actually in Italian, right? Lucia. All right. Lucia, uh, Lucia Pacheco. All right. Um, what is the object of this sentence, Lucia? I think the live aid concert. The live aid concert, right? Very good. Good job, Lucia. The live aid concert. All right. The live aid concert, what, guys? Was played. Was. Was. Performed. Played. Actually, guys, it should I be queen. performed, okay? It, it was performed. The, the verb should be performed, guys, okay? Performed. By Queen, and what is the compliment? In the in the eighties. Good job. 80s. All right, good job. Applause for you guys. Very good. All right, very good. Okay, guys, I think guys, you are pretty smart, right? I think you you guys understand pretty well. All right. Um, now I do want to give you another another example, guys. Day. Okay, let's talk about day. 
Because I want you to notice something. Give me an example with day, guys. Who wants to give an example with day? Give me a crazy example with day. Uh -huh. The Lakers. Gone. Oh, the Lakers, okay. The, the Lakers. Lakers won. The Lakers won. The championship last year. Okay, the Lakers won the championship. The championship. The championship. Last the last year. championship. I right, last year. Okay, very good. I like this. I like this example. Okay. All right, guys. So, what is the object of this sentence, guys? All right. Let's see. Jimmy Alvarado. What is the? Uh, my favorite guys. If you have. Hold on. I'm just gonna mute everyone, guys. All right. Very good. All right. So the object, what is it? The object of the sentence. Um, let's see who has not participated. Jimmy, Jimmy, are you there? Jimmy. Jimmy Kimmel. Oh. All right. Jimmy, yeah. what, what is the object of this sentence? Uh, the champions. Like... All right. Very good. The championship, right? The championship, All right? So the championship, right? What comes after, guys? What comes after the object of the sentence? Uh, Carla Gabriela, what, what, what comes after? Was won. Okay, very good. Was. The championship was won. Very good. Why is it was and not where, guys, if we're talking about the Lakers, which is which is a plural? Because it's a team. A team. No, guys, Only that one. is not Only. the reason. The reason why is because is singular. It's a the championship, right? The championship now is the, the subject. Only the one champion. According to the verb agreement, guys, champion. according to the verb agreement, you have to use uh, the, the, the verb has to match the subject. In this case, the championship became, I mean, the championship became what? The subject or the, the object? Subject. Subject. The, okay, subject. very good. The championship is the, uh, is the subject of the sentence now, right? So the championship was, was what? Won. Won. Was won. And then what else, Carla Gabriela? By the Lakers. Okay, it was Last won by year. the Lakers. Last year. Last year. Very good, guys. Okay, good job. All right. Is there any way that, guys, that we can use where? Could I use where somehow? What about, what about, uh, what about this example, guys? Your mom took care of my children. Huh, what about that example? All right, in that example, Pedro Castillo, what is the object of the sentence? Mr. Pedro Castillo, you, you are muted, sir. What is it? My children, right? Very good, guys. My children, plural or singular, guys? Plural. My children is a plural noun, right? My children were, not was. Why, guys? Why is it were, not was? Because we're talking about plural. Okay, my children were. All right. My children were taking care of by. This is, this is, this is, uh, guys, taking care of, okay? That's, that's a phrase of verb, okay? Take care. All right. My children were taken care of by your mom, mom. okay? Mom. All right? Taking care of is a whole phrase of her, guys, okay? All right? So that's how you say it. Is this clear, guys? Clear? Or do we need another example? <laughs> I think I With gave it where, to where, please? With where? Okay, very good. Okay, hey, you're, you're, you're the bosses here, okay? All right, we can say they. So give me an example with they, guys. Let's just say, no, no, actually, no, the, remember this, the, the object has to be in plural, right? So let's, let's have another example. Who can give an example, guys? Remember that the object of the sentence has to be a plural noun. Okay. 
Okay, uh -huh. they. Remember, guys, you can say they as the as subject of the sentence, but the the object of the mm. sentence is the one that will actually alter the form of the verb be in passive voice. Okay. All right. So let's say they. Okay. Here, actually, let's say uh, Shakir. Okay, Shakira. Shakira, what? And Chayang. Shakira and Cheyenne, okay, Have Shakira and Cheyenne. Children. Okay, Shakira and Cheyenne. <laughs> hey, I didn't bring up Sha Shakira, guys. That was that was you, okay? That wasn't me. All right, Shakira and Cheyenne. Raised, okay? Raised. Raised. No, let's um, play. Um. Now, let's say play video games. Better. Okay, the concert. Better who? Played, played a lot of, actually, okay, performed a lot of concerts. Uh, together. Okay, Cheyenne, I mean, Shakir and Cheyenne performed a lot of concerts together. Fantastic concert. Okay, all right, Shakir and Cheyenne performed fantastic, a lot of fantastic. All right, let's add the adjective here, fan. The Michael Gonzalez. Concerts together. All right. Uh, at El Magico Gonzalez. Okay. Oh All right, guys. All right. All right, guys. So who wants to try? All right, do my favor, guys. Let's see. Actually, you do this one, okay? Send me <sighs> your answer, guys. Send me this sentence in passive voice in the chat room, okay? Let's go. All right, and then I'll correct you. Okay, so everybody, guys. All right, so it is um, 20 people. I need to see 20 examples in the chat room. Okay, let's go. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Don't copy. Don't copy. Okay. No copiation. <laughs> That's not copiation, guys. That's a made-up word. Okay. All right. All right, guys, let me see those examples. All right. Jacqueline sent me her example. I see. Incorrect, Jacqueline. Try again. Try again. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. I'm sorry, Jacqueline. I, 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 uh, <laughs> I, I, I saw something else, Jacqueline. Uh, okay. All right, Jacqueline. Good job, Jacqueline. Good job. Thank you. Great. Uh, Lucia, Lucia, that that is incorrect, Lucia. Let's let's change that. Remember, uh, the thing, with Lucia, is that the object of the sentence becomes the subject of the sentence in passive voice. Okay. El objeto de la oración se convierte en el sujeto de la oración en en la voz pasiva de la oración. Right. That's the concert word performance. Okay, All right. Yeah. Yeah, uh, let's see, Jimmy. A lot of fantastic concerts were performed by Shakira and Gianna. I El Mike Gonzalez. I I cocktails. No. <laughs> All right. At right. At not I. But I think that's a a typo. All right. Uh, Blanca. The Beatles were famous in the 1960 years. All right. That is not the right example, Blanca. Um, Rocio. El Mexico Gonzalez was a lot of fantastic concert. No, no, Rocio. No, all right. We'll, we'll explain why. We'll explain why, Rocio. 
All right, uh, Jorge, El Mágico González was performed. No, nope, that is incorrect, Jorge. I'll explain why again. Uh, Jocelyn, uh, a lot of fantastic concerts were performed by Shakir and Shan together at El Mágico González. Good job, Jocelyn. Victor, a lot of fantastic, a lot, a lot of, okay, fantastic concerts were performed by Shakir and Shan together at El Mágico González. Good job, Victor. Uh, Luis Molina. Now, be careful, guys. Personal nouns, guys, they have to be capitalized, okay? And don't forget about periods, All right? And Michael Gonzalez, it's a, it's, a, it's a noun, guys, that has to be capitalized. It's a proper name, all right? A proper noun, a proper noun, I'm sorry. All right, uh, Luis Molina, a lot of fantastic, fantastic concerts, not fantastic concerts. It's the other way around, uh, Luis. We're performed okay. by Shakir and Cheyenne together at El Michael Gonzalez. Good job. Ricardo, a lot of fantastic concerts were performed by Shakir and Chan together. Very good. Good job, Ricardo. And Michael Gonzalez were performed incorrect, Eduardo. We'll explain why again. Pedro, a lot of fantastic concerts were performed. Okay, uh, Michael, Jorge, a lot of fantastic concerts were performed. Good job, Jorge. Uh, Blanca, Michael Button, Celine Dion offered fantastic concerts. All right, uh, that's not the right example, Blanca. All right, guys, good job. Almost everyone, Leah, uh, the fantastic concerts were. All right, remember, concerts, guys, okay? Is it concerts was or concerts, concerts were, guys? Concerts were, were. Concerts were, okay? Not concerts was because it's a plural. Oh, okay. It's yeah, a plural noun, okay? Okay. Right. Okay, very good. Uh, Okay, guys, good job, guys, good job. Okay, and applause for you guys. Good, good, good job. All right. Now, guys, um, some of you made some mistakes, okay? So, let's see. What we're going to do, guys, okay, uh, most of you, like, probably like 70% of you guys understood perfectly. What we are going to do, guys, okay, uh, is that I want you to explain to your partner okay what how we use this okay so we're gonna ask one question okay let's talk about the past so talk about uh life in the past all right for example guys now this is what you're gonna be talking about right now guys you're gonna practice right now and this is what you're gonna be talking about okay all right what are you gonna do guys what are you gonna do right now um, I don't yes. understand. Can you repeat, please? What we gonna do? You are gonna talk about life in the past. Okay. So what are you gonna do, guys? Talk life. about life. In the past. Okay. So for example, okay, you can say, "All right, trains were used by people in the past to travel across the country." All right, so uh, now guys, now we don't have, we actually don't use trains to travel around the country, right? But in El Salvador, guys, back in the days, trains were used as means of transportation to travel across the country, okay? So I want you to talk about the past, guys, okay? That's it. I want you to talk about life in the past, things that we don't have here anymore. Clear? Okay. Yes, 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 okay. Very good. Yes. All right, and also, guys, for people who did not understand how to transform into, you know, the sentences into passive voice, do my favor and just explain them as well, okay? All right, let's go, guys. All right, guys. Let's practice. Hello. Good night, Carla. Hello, Eduardo. Um, um, what, what, How was life in the past? That's it. That's the question. Okay. Um, the CDs was 
used by other people, but right now, um, some people use uh, new apps to listen to music. Uh, repeat, please. <laughs> What what do you do you think about the the passive voice? <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, tell me about your your different event in the past ten. In the past tense, I I let me check. I in this day I I cook. I cook. Uh, I was cook in, in the morning. I was cook cook my. I was cooking. I, wa I was cooking my my what in the morning my I was cooking my my breakfast in the morning. Yeah, because uh, maybe this day I I woke up early. Oh. Uh, what what about you? Can you cook? Hey, can you cook pizza? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I I I don't I don't like it. We're just talking about life in the past, and I don't know if we we gonna use the passive voice. I don't know. Just talking the past. I mean, the passive voice will you know, uh, passive will, passive voice will come out naturally. Just talk about life in the past. Well, trains like like how life was like in, in the past, you know. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. So, okay. So, um. Hi, hey, David. Hello. Oh. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> uh, my husband. Play the guitar, the very, uh, the guitar very good, or oh, very good the guitar. Very, very well. My husband plays the guitar very well. Ah, oh, okay. The guitar. Okay. Uh, I say an example. It yes. was. Uh, <laughs> uh, the DVDs was used to. Watch movies in CDs. Okay, but very now, good. Yeah. Now, when we say DVDs, is that plural or is that singular? Oh, um, I don't see, and I'll say. DVDs. <laughs> I don't know. DVDs. Oh, it, it, it is, is that many things or one like thing? Plural. DVDs. Plural. Very it's good. one thing. It's plural. Yes. Oh, one, one of them. Yes, the the the. the Oh, you the mean the DVD player? Cosita. Okay, you're not talking about the DVD player. Yes. <laughs> okay, you're talking about the DVD. The <laughs> the, the player okay uh, see this uh, is what's in plural Barack, Barack Obama was a famous president in the USA No le escucho. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, guys. Yes, so yes, Barack Obama was a, uh, was a famous president in the United States. Oh, okay. Then All right. Stay. Very good. Uh, All right, continue. Keep it no, up, guys. No, teacher, teacher, no. it, it, it is not correct. Uh, what? It, it is not correct. Uh, USA. Yeah, you can say... Uh, well, if you're going to say of the United, well, I don't know. It depends on what you want to say. Uh, you can okay. say Barack Obama was, was a famous president in the USA. I mean, you can okay. say that. Yes. Very, very good. Thank All right. You. Good job. Good job, girls. Okay. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, hey, teacher. Hi. Hi. Teacher. Hello. All right, guys. So let me, hear, let me hear your examples. Uh-huh. 
Okay, we were talking about um, about music. Uh -huh. The people used um, the tocadiscos. That's the name, right? Okay, I mean that's the name in Spanish. Yeah, but I don't know how can I say it in English. Uh, I think deck, you call deck. it the what? Deck. Yeah. A deck. Uh, no. It's tor tournament disc. All right. Uh, you call them a record player. Cool record player. Record player. Yes, a record player. Actually, a record player. Yes. Oh, nice. A record uh -huh. player. A record player. And about the where people use use um used horses to go to the downtown and and something like that. Okay, all right, all right, that's a good example. All right, very well done, all right? Uh, we're gonna go back now because it's almost time, but good job, all right? Okay. okay. Good job. Thank you. Thanks to you guys. The, the old park in the city were open. Um, oh, if we're one, talking about a singular noun, the old park is one thing, right? So the yes. verb be in the past is what? Where? Was. Okay. Old, the old park old in parks, the city was. In the city, in the city, was yes. opened uh, one month ago. Okay, it was opened <clears throat> a month ago. Okay, very good. All right. Very good, okay. We're gonna go back now, guys. So, hello guys, welcome back. All right, guys, so uh, good job, guys. Okay, the majority of you understood, guys. All right. Uh, guys, um, did we all understand? Did we, did we all understand this topic? How confident do you feel now? More or, or less. Clear, more or less. All right. We're going to have more practice about this tomorrow, guys. So the, the whole point is that you practice, right? Uh, remember, guys, that we have a channel on YouTube, okay? Uh, I upload the videos every day. So if you want to go ahead and give them, you know, uh, give them a watch, again, then you can go ahead and do so. Uh, I think that you you received, uh, you know, the, the link uh, to watch the videos on the YouTube channel, okay? All right. Aside from that, guys, uh, that's it. All right, guys. I had Thanks. a lot. I had. I had a lot of fun with you guys. Uh, does anybody have any questions, guys? Questions, questions, questions. No, I don't have questions no question. for me. No questions. Right. We're gonna be doing. Just, the... just to confirm. Sorry. Uh, just to confirm, we can uh, huh? have classes tomorrow. Yes, guys. We do have a class tomorrow. Yes. Uh, yeah, we All question. Right. We have class. Very good. Right. You, need to come. you need to come Teacher. to class, guys, because Jacqueline is going to buy pollo campero para todos, okay? <laughs> it's not true. <laughs> that is no, it's all gone, huh? Oh, somebody said teacher. That's, yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> no, it's not a good idea. Yeah. I dieta. <laughs> We are not yeah. fat. <laughs> it's not right. because you are fat. It's tomorrow. just because for being <laughs> for health. healthy. Uh, healthy. Okay. Yeah. Hey, but uh, I think I think for your campaign is healthy, right? Yes. Oh, no. It's tomorrow. no healthy. Oh, healthy. Oh, oh, it's like a pizza. <laughs> right. All, right. All right, guys. Okay, guys. So in that case, that's it, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Take care, guys. See you Have tomorrow. Bye. Thank you, teacher. Bye. Tomorrow, Bye. teacher. Bye. Bye. Tomorrow, Bye. teacher. Bye. 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 Bye.